Hello, kings, queens, nerds, and geeks. Welcome back to another video. Uh, and sorry, I look like shit. I just got back from a very long vacation, and my god, it was fantastic. But um, today we'll be talking about uh, my hero academia in this video. And as you can see, I'm wearing my plus ultra shirt just for the occasion, and I'm also wearing my my icy my fire and ice pants for Todoroki. So, but uh, today, um. It's going to be a theory video. It's, it's, we're going to theorize something here, and I think it's going to be very plausible. Very plausible. And I think we should... Ah, man, this is going to be fantastic. So, today, we're going to sit... I believe that Todoroki is a twin. Now, guys, I'm not saying that he is the twin brother of Zuko. No, I'm not talking about that. No, I mean he is a twin, and I'll explain this right now. But he's not just any twin. He is a twin chimera. And now we'll get right into it, shall we? First, let's go on to the definition. Now, uh, now chimerism is actually a known term. You mostly see it in cats. But it's very rare and very plausible thing that being a chimera is a real thing. So, to be precise, there's different forms of chimerism. But the one we'll be talking about today is called twin chimerism. And here's the definition. So... So, here's the definition of twin chimerism. So, the more extreme form of chimerism can occur when a pair of twins is conceived and one of the embryos dies in the womb, and then the surviving fetus may absorb some of the cells in its deceased twin, this giving the surviving fetus two sets of cells, its own, and some of its twins. Now, another way of this happening is also, pos is also hold on a sec here, let me change my camera here, Another example of this happening is when the tw when the twin, so to speak, um, when the two twins conjoin together. So, usually conjoined twins, you know, you usually just see them like one part of the body is stuck to the other in in some way form of way, which explains the two headed girl, the two headed girl and all that stuff. But there is also uh, some instances where they fuse fully. And no one knows about this and nobody understood. Some people will notice random patches of skin on their body. In some extreme cases, they actually end up developing their twins' organs instead of their own. One instance for, for in one case where a woman was giving birth, but they took her kid away because the DNA didn't match. And the, here's the reason why. Because they actually, according to the DNA, she would be the child's aunt. She developed her twin sister's uterus rather than rather than her own, which is pretty cool. In some one instance, a woman has a second heart next to her other one, which is about a golf ball size, and it doesn't work. Some people have actually developed more organs, such as extra kidneys, or um, or a sec, or a, or a extended, like, um, what's the word? Intestines. Some It's really weird. It's really weird and really cool. It's... You can imagine yourself like noticing random patches of your skin, just like of a different texture, for example. Some people have noticed that their skin color is random and patched, which sometimes people assume that's some kind of, you know, birth defect. But it but it is a birth defect in some way, but it's not your own DNA. Which can you imagine having two sets of DNA? That is ridiculous. Now, here's this. Now I'm gonna Continue on with this theory because I do believe he is his own twin in some way. Because more common than not, twins occur more when children, more children are present. Women are more likely to produce twins the more children they have, which is very likely since he has three other siblings. And it's not very far; it's not far fetched that he could have a twin. And and who knows how many miscarriages possibly happen? Like he could have more like siblings than he actually that is stated. That, it, but we're not gonna get on that. So imagine that he's two twins, and it also worked. Actually, in fact, if the fact that he is half down the middle like that could explain why he has two quirks. Like he has a cold quirk and a hot quirk, and it explains why it only works on one side or the other because only the twin, what first twin, can only use the ice power while the other twin can only use the firepower, which would have been cool if they were a tag team, you know? But he uses both, and he can only use it on a specific side. It, it does make a lot of sense. 
Oh, God. It also explains why he has a lot of, like, temper... Why he's so susceptible to his own powers like that. It ex explains so much why he could... Why he could get hypothermia and overheat at the same time. There's a lot to think about. Like, think of the implications of all that. Now, guys, that is all I really have for today. I don't have any more info to add to this. I tried looking up some videos that would probably be good for this, but I don't think I should be putting these ones. I probably might get copyrighted. But, uh... Chi well, that's all. That's uh, chimerism, and Todoroki might be a, a chimera rather than you know having two quirks. It could be just the simple fact of a birth defect, which makes him even greater mutation than mutation than what he already was. Now, I hope you guys would enjoyed this video and find, found it pretty I found it pretty cool. If you guys want me to do more theories and more anime videos, just let me know. Oh, so, uh, I'll also talk about other theories you guys want me to talk about, or other animes you want me to review. Uh, anyway, guys, I'll catch you guys later, and stay dirty, my friends. Bye-bye!